Well, good day to you on a grey day here, which uh, promises rain, but promises way beyond that what should be a really good game of football. The stands are packed here, people have done everything they can to get here. Indeed, the roads outside were pretty badly clogged, but I think most of the traffic issues have been settled, and indeed, I think most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements, whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two. Old Trafford rising to the occasion as only Old Trafford can. Some terrific scenes at the Stratford end. They got on the way here pretty promptly. Danger averted for now. Sterling. And here's... He's gone for it! Bruno Fernandes gets rid without sophistication. Sure. Gomez. Forward it goes. Manchester United, clearly one of the informed teams in the league right now. Five wins out of five coming into this game, and hopes for them are rising all the time. Dybala. Oh, good interception. And it's played forward. Richarlison. That's great strength on the ball. Plays a clever pass. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. Working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's uh, it's where the room is. Sancho takes the long option. It's a goal kick. Delf gets it out to the wing. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Bruno Fernandes, his team in front on his last appearance with a first half goal from that fine cross. Bruno Fernandes. Could move up a gear here. It is deadlocked. Dybala, Sterling, hits one! Oh, attempt, just the wrong outcome. Uh, that's a little unfortunate, he had a lot of people worried then. Wan-Bissaka puts himself back in the starting side for the first time in a while. And the through ball is intercepted. And here's Sterling. And it's Shaw. Surely a shot! Wan-Bissaka does well to read it and intercepts. Delf, Delf drives it forward, he gets past his man, and he's there to cut it out. Defenders on the back foot, there's a long ball, and it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Hoists it forward. Gomez. Bruno Fernandes tries to get it forward quickly. Richarlison! Oh, just misses past the post. 
Oh, how close was that to going in? It only required the smallest of tweaks. Shaw. And we've reached half time. So now the team has broken through. <laughs> Not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. And still goals. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. And the game has already resumed here. Manchester United playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. And now the breakaway. Forward it goes. Rice gets into the right position to intercept. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Shapes to shoot! And he's there to make a great save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do it. And to Bola! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. That's a foul. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Just brushed off the ball there. Now it's Dibala. Keeper sends it forward. Shaw does well there. Alert. Ronaldo spreads it towards the left. And you can get that clear. Sterling! Lingered over it, and the chance to counter had gone. Oh, Peter, the best counter-attacks are, are pacey and incisive, we know that, and that one never really got going. Sterling. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Calvert-Lewin. Now it's Sterling. It's got through to him. It's a fabulous position. Has a goal! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. Manchester United really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Everton making consecutive changes here. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Dybala. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's Sterling. And Dybala! It's there! Finally the breakthrough! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. <laughs> Manchester United making another change here. 
So we have our breakthrough. Well, we certainly had to wait for it, Peter. Now a difficult decision. Is it stick or twist? Cristiano Ronaldo. Dybala. He's found his man. He had battles to win it back. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. Manchester United are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. Chilwell. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Manchester United are clinging on for the points here, right at the end. Tries a shot! Cleared without complication. Chilwell has it out wide and in space. Cleared away. Rice. Manchester United certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. It is just a question of running down the clock now. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Topa! Keeper's not concerned by that. And it's played forward. Chilwell was not to be moved. And it's Bernard. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. It's a brilliant interception. And that's it. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal in it. But that was enough. Well, this game looked to have nil nil written all over it, but credit to them. They upped their game in the end. And I thought they got what they deserved. Well, we've reached the end of our coverage for today. Many thanks to Jim Beglin alongside me, and we'll both see you next time.